Hello traders, welcome to ProBinary Bots Bot Development Tutorials. Today I'm going to develop a video for this comment. Uh, as I get you to know, he's asking how to make a list and from that list how to develop another new list based on some conditions. Uh, so let's develop this bot and first I will log in to, to this website. It's, uh, https learn.probinarybots.com it's learn. it's https learn.probinarybots.com i will get i will log into this website here we can find several guides for binary bot development it mentions best binary option brokers and here we can find this bot development tutorials and if you want to download these code blocks you can download this develop the code blocks by clicking here you can find the code blocks here and you can watch all the previous bot development videos from this link Okay, then I will log into binary bot platform by clicking here. If you don't have a binary.com account, you can open a new account by clicking here. Okay, I'll click here and log into binary bot platform. Here we are in the binary bot platform and I will reset the bot and I will change market to volatility 10 minutes and I will change here trade type to digit or even it's okay you can change it to anything you want and you don't want this thread call block so i will right click on it and delete then uh we want to make two lists okay uh, let's see what is the link uh, this name is abc in abc list whichever the values is below 4 and greater than 7 put those values to new low new list D E F. Okay, then we want to list A B C and D E F. So I'll create two variables. First one is A B C. Okay, then I'll create another variable D E F. Okay, now we have these two variables. Then I will go to click canvas and take this code block. This block is called on every tick. Then I will go to variable and connect set ABC to tick analysis advanced last digit list. So let's see what's inside this list. Um, take this and let's connect this ABC. Now let's run this bot. You can see it's a huge list. You can see it's a large list of numbers. So as in this comment is asking a list of about 10 digits. So I'll shorten this list to last 10 digits. So I'll from this list I'll take in list get a sub list from and then I'll connect to here. Then instead of this list, I will connect this last digit list here. And get sublist from number from the end, number from the end. From here, we change this to 10 and 2, number from the end, 1. Okay, now let's see what's inside this ABC list. 
uh, okay we can see 10 digits last 10 digits of the last digit list now he is asking uh, how to take a sub list from this list based on the condition okay i will add the condition first i will take this variable then i will take this set abc2 i will change it to def then i will set this def list to an empty list okay then from this advanced loop i can find for each item k in list okay i will take it and fix here and for each item k in list a b c then what we want to do is logic we want to add our condition here and code lock then we want to check whether this k greater than 4 of this variable k less than 7 I think it's correct 4 and 7 then what we want to do is create this add, add those digits to this DEF list. So I'll take variable set DEF2, click on list, create list with what? Whatever the variable in DEF plus this k variable okay we want don't want this k item to be right okay now it's okay uh if k is greater than four and if k, k is less than seven it will add to this def list so i will try to get a notification in green color telling me Create a list with DEF. Okay, text DEF. Okay, in blue color we need. in blue color we can see this ABC list, and in green color we can see this DEF list. Now let's see if it's happening or not. No digit greater than four and less than seven. If digit six or five should be appearing in if seven, two, seven, eight, eight, two, yes, this five. Okay, when 6 appears, it is appeared in this DEF list. Okay, 6 and 5 are in this DEF list. Okay, uh, this is strategy 30. Uh, that's about this comment and I will upload this code block to this website and you can download it from by clicking here download code blocks and that's about it thank you for watching my video
and if you have any questions or if you have any strategy to video test like this you can comment below thank you very much